It's the Koi Pond, and uh, I'm so happy you guys are diving in today. You like that? That's my new little thing. Nice Dive little in. Thing. Jump in. Jump in. Take a swim. Take a swim. A dip. Do a little dip. If you will. If you dip, I dip, we dip in the Koi Pond. Ooh. See bars. It. Someone else's, but I, bars. I see merch in the future. I see, I see merch. <laughs> My guy Dre, and then sitting in the wa- uh, we we like to call this the the, the white seat, mm, yeah, the white seat. Uh, my boy Andrew Lopez, how are you, man? Good to see you guys. Uh, up, well, okay. First of all, Andrew, I don't know if you're going into character right now, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> before before we started recording, you were laughing, <laughs> cutting jokes with me, and laughing, and now all of a sudden you're a librarian. <laughs> what are we too are we too loud in the library? What the fuck was that? You turned into uh, a hello, hello. Turned uh, into a fucking psychology professor. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. That oh, was weird. Yeah, yeah. During the test, yeah. if you guys could just talk to to <laughs> yourselves, if you don't mind. I'm trying to rebrand, dude. After the pandemic, I'm like trying to be a new person out in the world, be more of an adult. Oh, so that's called fake. Uh, <laughs> pull the microphone closer to your face okay, so we yeah. can hear you. I'm like learning how to re be back in, in around people again. Yeah. What, like you've I'm, never been around people at I mean, all? I truly, I'm one of those people that stayed home. Like I was like so scared. Wow. I was, yeah. I was a weirdo. So you were Andre. Yeah, I was I was at home too. Yeah, but, yeah. but I, I was gallivanting at Mervin's, <laughs> <laughs> Safeway, <laughs> and Staples. I would go to Staples just to I don't know, What's just walk on? around. <laughs> hey, you guys got highlighters? <laughs> they go, yeah, we do. Okay, cool. And then I'd leave, yeah. not even buy anything. I was thinking about this on the way over here. That you know how you could tell I've been at home for a long time how? because I got close to the studio. Yeah, and I was like, what the fuck am I wearing? <laughs> Yeah, you are bad. You are bad, bad. I didn't even realize that. Holy fuck. You are three shades of gray blue. I swear to God, I was like, what the fuck do I have on yeah. right now? It's, Where it's, am I going? Yeah, it's bad enough it's a cloudy day, but to dress like a cloud is another thing. What is Dre fucking wearing? These are two blues never. These, these are two blues people have hard times wearing by themselves, and you put them both together. Rock that it's shit. It's like a purple yeah, blue and a pumpernickel blue or some shit. Hey, man, YOLO. YOLO. <laughs> Is that still a saying? No. That's 2000, like, a long time right? ago. Yeah. It's 2000 back, with a dash. Yeah. Yeah. That, you know, you put the dash where you don't remember how long ago. YOLO. <laughs> Holy shit, Dre. I appreciate that. It's been long enough that it's cool again. You can bring it back. Yeah. No, yeah. you can't. <laughs> it's terrible. No, you can't. Too, too soon. Uh, you look good, uh, Thanks, Andrew. You look like you lost. I, I'm not feeling this. I'm not. What? I'm I not. Mean, I'm not feeling. No, you can cross your legs, oh. but the. It's the. Response. I feel like you're going yeah. into uh, a character when you respond. Just uh, the where we were with the yeah. blues. Yeah, yeah. How you were the the digs and the laughter, and then and yeah. then just keep that right there. Yeah. This I'm gonna do okay. an impersonation okay, of you. Okay, okay. All right, we're gonna come after a laughter. Uh, I'm gonna be you. We're laughing. I just I I threw two shots at Andre. Yeah, okay, yeah. all right, go. <laughs> <laughs> no, ask me a question. <laughs> ask me a question. <laughs> hey man, so what would you do for the last week? Uh, peace, love, <laughs> peace, love, and unity. Uh, yeah, it feels unity. fake, bro. Yeah. is that what I'm? Co I'm coming off that uh, bad. Peace and love. Uh, you know, that's it's my prayers. My prayers to anything that needs prayers. You know? it, it's almost like you think you're on a real podcast. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this is not. Man. This is this is, a, yeah, yeah, yeah. this is a this is a. I'm fun. just with friends, bro. That's it. There you go. There it is. There's <laughs> me, dog. So you're back. You're back. Back in LA, back you went in to LA. Iowa. I went to Iowa, bro. Where it was, uh, it was it, that shit was open, man. It yeah. was like, and then it's come back. I'm, but I was telling Dre when I got here, though. I'm, I'm retraining my brain to be open now, though. Like, I'm, well, I'm like, I'm, 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 I'm want, I want to go to a bar and get drunk. I'm gonna get the vaccine. I'm gonna dance. I think the YOLO thing is real. Like, if anything, the pandemic told me I only live once. So yeah, I'm gonna get the vaccine that's and get what fucked it is. up, dude. That's what? what brings YOLO back. What? Yeah. The fact that we've been in a pandemic. Yeah, you, you know really got to embrace YOLO it now. YOLO is real. Okay. <laughs> I, 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 I've been living my good life, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I've been yeah, doing yeah, everything, yeah, bro. Yeah. I see. Yeah, I'm coming from a place so of regret. No, I wish yeah, I was doing no what you yeah. did. <laughs> I think you guys just need to we're catch up. About. I have no idea what the fuck you're talking yeah. about. Did you see how I was acting three minutes ago? That's yeah. what pandemic fucked my brain. Yeah, up, it did dude. fuck you up. <laughs> I'm wearing chains now. I, dude. See I don't that. know what happened to me. I see that. Is that copper? <laughs> dude, this is 25 cents in one of those fucking put a quarter. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I hide. It looks like it. it. Copper? <laughs> it looks like 25 cents. <laughs> I think it's a girl's necklace, bro. I lost it. It doesn't there. matter. It doesn't even matter at this point. So so Iowa's open. Iowa's open, but 
I mean, people there, like, it was, it was, it, people were happy though, man. Like, of course they were happy. Yeah. You was, know why? Because it was open. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you yeah. want people to get happy again? Let's open it. Yeah, yeah, for real. I'm sorry. Okay, here's the thing. Like, I, I keep saying this and I stress it a million times. I get it. It's scary. I don't want, we know close people that have had it and, mm-hmm. and you know, we've lost people. Um, but I will say this. Um, what was I getting at? <laughs> It, it's one thing for you to tell us uh, how we need to act, right? Mm-hmm. And what we need to do for as far as safety precautions. But when you show us 10 players on the basketball court bleeding and sweating on top of each other and then going into a huddle and putting on a mask, it's a hard sell. I get it's that. a very, mm-hmm. very, very hard sell. I get and, that. And for the, for the sake of entertainment, I get it. But my guys, well, my guys, I got tested. I got tested. You did. In fairness, we don't know what people are doing out in the open, on the open range. In fairness, I don't know what they're doing. But that, but the assumption, no, the, not, but the assumption is that it's in a it's in a controlled environment. The assumption is they but are. But they're test, not. They they're going home. Huh? They're, are they still in a the bubble? The, the bubble? bubbles? I don't think they are. They go home. Oh, really? Okay. Yep. Okay. So, I. Well, Look, I'm not. I'm not saying it's a bad thing. What I'm saying is, it's a hard sell for me. Mm-hmm. Okay, you know, and and I think um, I bought it. I <laughs> I bought it. Yeah, you did buy it, yeah. and you enjoy basketball, and you're enjoying watching it. I, I don't. I I don't know what one, I don't know what one has to do with the other. What I'm honest. saying is that you're you're accepting the fact that it's okay for these men to sweat and I, bleed on top of each other. I don't even. I've never even had that thought <laughs> to be honest. Like I, I know, which even, means you accept it. That means you accept it. No, that means I you're never, watching it no, without never, even thinking about no, it. No, I never thought about it. I never, I never, I, I don't, I don't care about that. I under, I get that. Do you that. know what I mean? Like, it, it I understand really... that you don't care, but what it, but it's existing. So then that means you accepted it. Yeah. No, I don't care. I, 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 I <laughs> no, no, what I, I understand that you don't care. What I'm saying is that you're accepting the fact that there's people out there that are living their best lives. There, there are NBA players making millions of dollars that are allowed to sweat and, and spit and bleed on each other. Okay. You I, I, okay. And one, you could say that I accepted it. I'm just saying that I think that it's also, if you, if I try to find a justification for my yeah. own actions and yeah. in, in other things, yeah, I could do that for anything. I could do yeah. that. I could do that about anything. Yeah. Seriously. If I really wanted to. Yeah. Right. Like if I wanted to say, I don't know. These people are doing these drugs or these people are doing this or whatever they're doing. Yeah. I could justify that in my own life. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. But I don't, I don't because I don't, it doesn't, it, it, it doesn't relate to me because I'm not that. I'm not an NBA basketball player. I'm not an NFL player. I'm not, I don't, that's not my life. Yeah. My life is I have to go to Ralph's. Yeah, right. I get that. Right. But they're going to Ralph's too. I don't, they're they're I don't, humans. They're humans before they are. I don't know what they're doing. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what they're doing. No, I understand you don't know what they're doing. But what I'm saying is you're seeing a human being being able to do what they want to do. And it's acceptable. Okay. Mm-hmm. And they were doing it before the vaccine or anything else. They were just doing it with everyday test. And okay. like to me, if you can do that, then I should be able to do that without getting any type of criticism. If people are I shouldn't being, have to be are felt. Are people being tested? Yeah. What if people are not being tested? What if you don't know? Like if you're going... In a in an environment where there's two hundred people, yeah, and you don't know what anybody's status is, that yeah, is it, you're comfortable there. Yes, oh, I'm not. See, for me, it comes down to like the gut feeling of communication too. Where it's like, if I'm not gonna go, if I talk, like if I'm gonna go see somebody, I'll be like, what did you have? Have you been safe? And I'm gonna trust the people that I'm gonna see intimately mm-hmm. yes. to mm-hmm. tell me the truth. If they were like, I was sweating and hugging 50 <laughs> NBA players this week, and I'm like, well, I'm not gonna see yeah. you motherfucker. Like, yeah. I'm, I'm not gonna risk that. Yeah. But I think like, it, it's like the gut reaction of like, if I go to a Disneyland, I know what I'm getting into, cause I made that free will choice to go there. A good and time. And that's just, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'd a have a good time. time. Yeah. A good time with some <laughs> iconic uh, people. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Mickey Mouse iconic is characters. there. Yeah. Uh, Donald yeah. Duck, yeah. I believe, is yeah. a, a Disney character. Yeah. Yeah. Am I right or I, wrong? I, I, yeah. uh, rides. Yeah. My, uh, my, my friend just went to Florida and he went yeah. to Disney World down there cause they just, like, or, like Universal Studios or one of the two just opened up. Yes. He's like, no lines, bro. 
Up bro, every, of course, like, no best lie. time of my life. Bro. Of course, no lie. It's like best time of my life, bro. I was like, I gotta, I gotta get on a plane now. It's the best, yeah, it's actually the best time if you're gonna yeah. do anything. Yeah. If that's if that's your choice, it's yeah. the best time. Dude, to do the it. you are because time. there's no lines for yeah. anything. And He's socially distanced. There's no one there, and everything's gonna be cheap. Yeah, yeah. exactly. So cheap. <laughs> so cheap. <Yeah>. God. <laughs> so cheap. Like if you don't have a sale right now, yeah. Fuck your store. <laughs> Now's the time to have yeah. a sale, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. If you put on your... If I had a store right now, yeah. you know what I would say? Going out of business. Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> and everyone will believe it. Sure. And that going out of business store will be open for four years. <laughs> Who does, is that a trick? I think that's a trick that yeah, people do. Yeah, it is, right? Yeah. I think so. There's a furniture store in Ventura that's been going out of business <laughs> for like seven years. Like seven years. Yeah. <laughs> Same shit's in there in the window yeah. for all seven years. <laughs> Have you guys seen the new fall going out of business line? That's so true, right? I've seen a 75% off oh, a long 75%, time. 75%, by the way. 75%. Which means they marked it up one oh, yeah, million yeah. percent. Yeah. And then you get in and the coffee table's ten thousand dollars. You're like, 10, what the fuck? Dollars. Yeah, but you know, seventy five percent off. <laughs> it's twenty five hundred dollars. That's the original <laughs> price. Yeah. You liar. <laughs> you know what I don't understand the things that got more expensive during the pandemic I stayed in an Airbnb when I was in Iowa yeah. and the cleaning fee was more expensive yeah which fucking blew my mind because what was it what was I paying for before for the cleaning fee nothing like yeah. I don't understand like there's like like cleaning fees on Airbnb are two hundred dollars more because of the COVID thing yeah yeah but it's like isn't that just fucking cleaning I that right like that's <laughs> the only thing like so I don't understand things that got more expensive yeah uh, yeah there's definitely people that are taking advantage yeah, of the situation insane. well yeah. I mean I think with uh even with restaurants at, at one point they yeah. they yeah. started adding like a surcharge yeah 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 and you're like the cleaning COVID fee on the yeah. on the ticket you're like, like what like, really yeah uh, here's another thing uh you know due to cost and shit uh you guys are cutting back on giving certain things away that you normally free but um, give it to me when it's obviously that I when it's obvious that I need it, like a straw, yeah, like a uh, uh, table setting. Yeah, I just I just bought a full meal. Mm -hmm. This is uh this is salmon. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I'm gonna be needing. I, I, I need the utensil. forks and spoons. <laughs> ah. Well, you know, due to the panda, go fuck yourself. Yeah. I, I don't know how many restaurants I go to, and the, it's they don't bring it until you. So you ask. have to ask for it twice. I've no three times I've done that, and you have to where ask I have for a full basic. fucking meal in front of me, and I'm like, can can I get the knife in for? Oh, yeah. I didn't know you need. Yeah, I. What not a is caveman. the assumption? What is the assumption? What, what did you think? <laughs> <laughs> I, is it BYO tables at T? What is it TS? <laughs> bring your own table setting. What the fuck? I hate, you know what? Better yet. You ready for this, Andrew? Andrew Lopez, you guys. Uh, Andrew used to go on the road with me all the time. And, uh, uh, you know, and then you could also see him on In His Elements uh, on, uh, on Netflix. He, he went up as well. And, and we toured around uh, and checked out the Philippines. Yeah, that was your, time in my life. Thank you. Oh, for that was fun, man. Yeah. Uh, but um, here's, here's what I hate this whole bag situation in LA. Mm -hmm. I don't know how much it cost. What is it? Ten cents a bag, five cents a bag. I don't know what yeah. it is. Okay. <laughs> yeah. But if and I and I know it's your job to ask. Mm -hmm. Okay, I get it because it is five cents a bag. Mm -hmm. But if I have two shopping carts mm -hmm. filled to the rim, yeah. please don't ask me if I want bags. <laughs> Assume I want bags. I'm, I'm really getting sick of the dumb question. Until I don't I, know if you're an autopilot. I don't know if that's just something that you say, but bitch, <laughs> these are two shopping carts <laughs> with big box items. Until I say, no, 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 no. I won't need those. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring them out. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Until I say, I don't need bags. I need bags. Bro, you go to these mid, these, the, uh, 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 mid, middle America play, they are handed you bags. Yeah, yeah. You go to Walmart in in, in uh in, in Minnesota. Double mm -hmm. wrap bags. Yeah, double yeah. wrap tape. Yeah, and a handle. <laughs> I think if they ask Is you it, that question, they should be. Like, if you say no, then they have to carry the shit to your car. Yeah, carry you. it. You got to bring it with me and pack my yeah, car with. Pack me. my car. 
in their arms too. They have to <laughs> yeah, carry yeah. like we all have to all go together awkward now. and fumbling. Yeah, yeah. Oh, by the way, if I am if I am at the kiosk, ringing up my own stuff, mm-hmm. bags are free. <laughs> That's weird. Bags are free. No, they are. They should be. No, no, no. I'm just. Do uh, not charge me for bags when I'm doing your fucking job. <laughs> I have just become the shopper and the employee, and you're not going to reward me with a bag. Fuck you. I'm doing this without health benefits. I'm doing this without an apron. I don't have a name badge on my chest. I am ringing up. And by the way, I'm ringing up fast. Faster than anyone that's worked here ever. Put my plaque on the goddamn wall. Employee of the year, Joe Coy. Two shopping carts scanned and bagged in seven minutes. Right. That's my best time. And you're going to ask me how many bags? Oh, how many bags? How many? All of them. Yeah. As all many of them. As how I many need. you got? As many as I need. Got? What? What? I, I'm, these corporations got some nuts on them, bro. Is that the corporations or is that the state of California? Or is that like, is that an environmental thing? Is, I that, think is that what they, or are they cutting back? Or is that corporations? It's an environmental thing bags? that's usually in California and New York, I think, are the ones mm. that are, are, anyone that's close to the water, basically. Yeah. For pollution reasons, right? I think. Yeah. I'm guessing. Yeah. Uh, I'm assuming. But I'm just talking about the kiosk. Yeah. If you're going to have the balls to ask your paying customers sure. to also work for you, yeah. you need to reward them. With the bag. Compensate them. A bag, a goddamn. <laughs> if I'm buying, if I'm printing out my ticket to get on your plane, I want I want a goddamn pilot wings. I want a cool little captain's hat. <laughs> Give me something. I work here. I temporarily work here. I have made your job easier. And I will say this. I'm going to go, next time I come back on this pod, I'm going to find out how much you guys saved. Mm -hmm. Because I know you're saving a lot. Mm -hmm. Because you look at those kiosks, like you go to Target, there's a line for self-checkout. Yeah. And and there's usually six kiosks deep that that are being used. That's six employees. Yeah. That's six... Target employees that should have been working that lost their jobs because of this system. Mm-hmm. So you saved millions. Give me my fucking bag. <laughs> and and that I thought also, you were going to ask for wages. I should get a wage. <laughs> I should get a lunch break. <laughs> you Let me go to the break room real lunch quick. Lunch break for sure. Let me go to the break room real quick. Play spades with my boy Dre. <laughs> Ten minutes is all we want. <laughs> Let me tell you something, Dre. Dre. What do you mean I can't I can't get a quick smoke? <laughs> I've been shopping for three hours. I need a break before I scan this shit. Please. And here's the point. Here's union, another point. Rules. You remember that one pod I, uh, that we had where I said, "Beware your customer service," because mm-hmm. the more the more you act like this, mm-hmm. the more people are going to complain about how right. horrible your service is, and the more they're going to go to kiosk and robots to replace go you. Away. Yeah. So keep acting acting shitty at your job because yeah. you will get replaced by a robot. And and people don't understand this. A kiosk is a robot. Right. Yeah. That's a robot. It has officially replaced you. Be careful, man. Mm-hmm. It's happening. Yeah. You go to Target and I, I trip, man. There are more kiosks than there are employees. I miss the days of a clerk. I love talking to a clerk. How was your day? I love that, that whole energy right there. Yeah. It's gone. Yeah. Watch out, you guys. It's down to one clerk. I There was 17 registers, man. Mm-hmm. One clerk working. Yep. There was a line for self-checkout. Yeah. Be careful. Be careful. I, I went to a gym. I worked out at a gym. You ready for this, Isaac? Yep. I worked out at a gym. I can't remember what city it was in. I'll just make it up. I'll say Tampa Bay, Florida. These fans came to my uh, my uh, my show. I, I, and if you're listening, I, please DM me and, and correct me, uh, the city and your name. The guy owned his own gym, right? He goes, you can work out at my gym, man. I go, dude, what's your hours? He goes, whatever you want. It's 24 yeah. hours. I go, what? He goes, yeah, man. I'll give you the code. You just type in the number. You yep. walk in, use the facility, clock out, and boom. Yep. You can get water and towel and all that. I go, what do you do? They have surveillance cameras. Yeah. It watches everything you do. Damn. So if you steal, they got you. Yep. Everything. It's literally a workout area. There's no clerk, no nothing. There's a wet bar. There's water. You can grab it. You can get uh, drinks, energy drinks. It's all accounted for. They monitor you. It, it's it's crazy. Yeah. And that's a perfect example of these businesses going virtual. Yeah. Yeah. 
He's literally watching his business on his iPhone. That's how he showed me. He goes, look. He was showing me a, a dude working out. He's like, this dude's working out right now. Wow. I was like, what? But I mean, that's the thing that people that work in service have to understand that because robots don't get sick. Yeah. They yes. Don't, they, don't, they don't complain. They don't have health insurance. They don't, <laughs> and they don't need it. Yeah. Guess what else robots don't need? 401k. Right. Right. <laughs> don't need it. Yeah. You know what they need? A wall socket. <laughs> <laughs> That's all they want. A nice, good-looking wall suck. Yeah, so from from Plug a me in. from an employer's perspective, they're like, yeah, hey, man. But these employees don't see it, Dre. I know. They don't get it. I, I, I don't know. They I don't, don't know see why. it, Andrew. Yeah. It's sad. Yeah. It's, it's this new generation. I hate being the old man, but I am. My dad used to say that shit. You know what I mean? He used mm. to do this, oh, it's your, this young generation. But I think we're dealing with a whole new whole new weird generation that no one has ever seen before. Yeah. Cause at least you and I were a little bit similar to our parents' generation. Mm -hmm. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? We had the introduction of electronic. Yeah. I don't even know how to say it. Like technology, technology. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There was this, but it was still like my dad kind of saw that technology as well. You just have a better version of our TV. Yeah. 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 Now we got yeah. motherfucking holograms that look like Tupac. Yeah. 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 And they're headlining festivals. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right. And these kids paid money to see yeah. Tupac with Dre again. Right. Right. That's the technology that we can't. I don't even com that doesn't. Yeah. I, I don't even comprehend that. Yeah. But let me ask my you, son comprehends. Let me ask you this question. So when you and this is answer, you can answer it too. If 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 you grow up in an environment where like freelancing, like like freelance work is is kind of the norm. Cause we didn't have that. We had mm -hmm. you go get your ass to a fast food spot and yep. and figure it out. Yeah, figure it out. Um, these kids are growing up. You know, 12, 13, 14 years old. This they, is they're, they're already having yeah. freelance jobs. Yeah, so they're quick to be like, "Fuck this job." Yeah. yeah. Well, I also I also wonder though if they're they're actually figuring out stuff, making things better, right? Like think about like uh like with Wall Street, like yeah. With Robin Hood, like yeah. back even when I was growing up, I'm like younger than you guys, but even when I was growing up, we had a we had a stocks uh, unit in like social studies or whatever, yeah. and we did the newspapers yeah. and we like pretended did a mock thing where you had to call one of our classmates and they put in the stock for you, yeah. and you did all that shit. But mm. now you could just pick up your phone and bet five hundred dollars on the stock market right now, and yeah. kids are making more money than I've ever made day trading, and they just they made stock trading easier. So like. <laughs> What if they're making everything easier and we just yeah, are I'm, scared of that? I'm, I'm like, because like, here's the thing about my McDonald's order, right? McDonald's, they all have those 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 robots that are doing yep. it. There's no like, I don't know if you've been to one yet, but they they have all the kiosks now instead yeah. of actual people. Yeah. And uh, wait, where? Like the one the one in Culver City has really yeah. There's no cashiers. It's mm -hmm. just Get all stands. Bro, I, mean, I don't know where I've I've seen, but I have seen. Yeah, yeah. and it's bro, crazy. But you That's know what's crazy? But you know what's insane about it is the speed is crazy because everyone's just in the back yep. making the food mm -hmm. and then i put it in there and i get it way faster wow. than the cashier so maybe by the way I, i'm not asking oh by the way i'm sorry i didn't mean to interrupt you i do that a lot i'm so sorry i'm not i'm not amazed at the fact that there were kiosks at mcdonald's i have seen those what i'm saying is you you're saying there's one in culver city where there's no registers there's there's like one register that works and it's all old people in the line everyone else just goes up to the kiosk and just does it on like a yeah. giant ipad that's and there's like seven of them. So yeah. like, and you don't have to wait in line. Wow. Because they all just go to the back. But and, and what do you mean by old people? What are you, what are you, it's all like, it's all at? people using cash that's doing What's wrong with cash. that? Yeah, what's wrong with old people? It takes so long, bro. This is where I'm on the other side. I think that it, it, like technology's made everything so much easier, dog. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. So, okay, so this is good. Yeah. Because you're still, are you 30 yet or no? I'm 30, yeah, yeah. So, uh, so you're still, your, your ear is still to the ground mm -hmm. and, and you are part of that generation yeah, I feel like so there are, you don't know. So you don't know what it's like to throw twenty single dollar bills at someone's. Here's the thing: I did do that when workstation. And, like, and, hey, and hey, by the at, way, at someone's yeah. workstation, and you're standing in the line at the kiosk, going, "What the fuck is taking so long?" That's you. Yeah. That's your mindset. Well, see, there they are. Those are amazing. But like, well, here, here's yeah, the thing: those though, are amazing. I I used to work in fast food when I was in high school. Yeah. Yep. And the thing about it was just the system was all was horrible. It was a horrible job. I hated it. They always say you have to go through the ringer to get like a better job, yeah. but now you don't. Yeah. That's it. Like, that's true. And everything about it is just a bad, broken system. Like yeah. the amount of money and cash that like, we had a kid at our fast food place that I worked at in Iowa that would just steal money from the register every single night, yeah. never got caught. 
Mm-hmm. And then like that, that system is broken. But now like, can I say something? Yeah. Uh, your management team, uh, they were idiots. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah. Cause, yeah. Cause I, they were also kids. Guess what? <laughs> yeah. yeah no shit. I, by the way, I know who stole out that yeah. register. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. his register. Yeah. Yeah. He's yeah. the only one with the key. Yeah. He's the only one with the money. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Steve, you're, you're short again. <laughs> yeah. It's crazy. I don't know what happened. <laughs> Yeah, I, guess somebody will reach up. I guess when I turn my back, someone yeah. reached over. <laughs> no, Steven. <laughs> Drives away in a new Prius. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but okay, I think so, they so fixed you, it. You like it. I love it. So love you it. think you think with the rise of digital money, Bitcoin and all that. Hell yeah. I'm you all love it. About all it, bro. Over, yeah. I, I put $2,000 on GameStop this morning, dog. Yeah. It's on great. On GameStop. Yeah, on GameStop. But yeah. it's just one of those things where I think, you know, there are things that, like, for instance, Zoom, right? Zoom has made it so much easier for meetings I don't want to go to. Mm. I just Zoom it up. There's no bullshit on these things. It's all work. But if I want to go meet up with somebody, then I'll do that in person. Like, yeah. I so think you like the Zoom meetings. I love the Zoom meetings, bro. Like, yeah. I you think like to get it done just if, because if it's work. Yeah, if it's work, just yeah. get it over with. I do miss the camaraderie of like, you know, drama talk at the office. But if there's like some podunk thing I don't want to go to and don't want to waste my time with, I'll do it yeah. on Zoom. But don't you, don't you feel that? Uh, that, that, that takes away from the real life energy instead of yeah. being connected through fake energy. But Cause I that's it's fake balance, energy, right? I think it's balance. Is it though? I think so. It's like the idea of like, I've, I, I've been trying to do this new thing. Hold with, on. Let me just, yeah. let me just state the point. Cause I know you're, you're about to, uh, I just want to stay here because there's a difference between, cause I've been taking massive zoom meetings lately. Yeah. Massive. Yeah. We're 15 in a room right now. I'm going to tell you right now, if I was in a room with 15 chairs and a big table, we would be knocking out some amazing fucking content and everything. I, I think to your point, sorry, not to cut you yeah. off, but, but, but for creative stuff, yeah, yeah. I think absolutely 100%. But isn't every meeting about being creative? Not everyone. I think that's the answer. It's the balance of it. Like, I agree with that. I totally want to be in the room for something like that. Yeah. But if I have to have coffee with some cousin that I never met who wants to be an actor that well, then, is from yeah, like, I'm doing that on Zoom. But then that's and, just a meeting. That, yeah, exactly. I get that. And that's the thing. Is that that's like, not a date or anything. That's just catching up. Totally. <laughs> Fuck it. Yeah. I totally. do that that's motherfucker what, too. That's what I'm, saying. That's I'm talking that's... about finances though. I'm with, talking about you, the, the like, like when it has to deal with like your work specifically. Yeah. If you have to write a script for a movie. You'd rather do that on Zoom or how how much more creative would you be in the room? But you know what's crazy about that is that it's a balancing again with that. If I have a one hour spurt and I got to do a rewrite and I've, so if I'm doing a rewrite with somebody on Zoom, I know I'm going to get, I, my, my attention span is not going to be as long on Zoom, but I'll get done stuff done faster on Zoom. I get that. Okay. But mm-hmm. I want to argue with you now. I yeah. want to debate with you because you can't take away that human connective energy. Okay. There's no, you, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like you and I in the room. Is is fucking ten times better than you and I on Zoom. 100%. We'll still write, yeah. and we'll still get it. But I, I guarantee it ain't gonna be the shit that we'd have in the room. Yeah, that's true. The shit in the room yeah. is gonna be fucking yeah, amazing. That's true. Yeah. Here's a good question because think, we're connected. Yeah. By, as humans, we're connected. But here's a question too: Is like I think we feed off of connection like that. That's very obvious for people like us. But I wonder if somebody who doesn't like these Type A like compute people who are already human computers. Yeah, like, yeah. Do they? I don't hang out with them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> is that my camera? <laughs> I don't have one friend. I don't even know who you are. You don't exist in my world. <laughs> But I w- do they love I, Zoom? I go ahead. Go ahead. Do they love Zoom? Cause yeah. That? Because it's just like I they they shut down in meetings and they yeah. can just be all business on because they're a fucking computer. Yeah. But I the, don't know. I mean, the hard part about that, is, is, especially coming from the previous generations, is that you, it, in the back of your mind, you know that yeah. you have to adapt. Yeah. Because it's move. The train is moving without you, mm-hmm. regardless. Yeah. You know what I mean. So You're even right. even there's a lot of stuff that we feel like, oh man, I I really wouldn't. I'd rather do it the way I'm comfortable doing it. I don't like. I don't like this. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This doesn't feel right to me. You yeah. still have to find some some medium because otherwise you're gonna be you're gonna be lost. Yeah. yeah. That's true. Here, I I actually heard this. Oh, thing. I want to yeah. say something. I I hate doing this <laughs> because I, I I I'm thinking about what you just said. Yeah, there are those guys that are silent in the room, but you know what they're absorbing? Energy. And you can't forget that. And I can and I and, and I would love to meet those what what would you call them? What type of type person? A, was type that? A, like I would love to meet those type A persons. And I and I can literally tell you that 
creatively, even though they're not saying anything in the room, that energy that's bouncing off the fucking walls is changing his chain, uh, his or hers cha- train of thought. Totally, totally one agree. billion percent. Totally, agree. it's like falling in love. Like you can't fall in love on Zoom. I think. Right. Yeah. Like, right. People who are doing these like online dating on yeah. Zoom, there's no energy there. It's all no. fake energy. Yeah. yeah. And it, I, I, I totally agree with that. But I, I you know, I, I heard this theory about the thing that like it's all about this. But Elon Musk was like saying this in this one interview where the you want to make technology so everyone's life is easier, right? Yeah. That's what technology exists for. But what if the technology, it's not that like they become like Will Smith robots, like iRobot, and they just start killing all of us because they have brains. But the idea is that the technology wants to make the world easier and it realizes that humans make the world harder. So they try to make the world easier by killing half of the humans. Okay. You're saying, Bias okay, first scary. of all, don't ever fucking say that because you just scared me. <laughs> yeah. You just but scared me. Here's the example. Here's can the example. I tell you why? Yeah, but, yeah. I believe that. Yeah. Here's the example. Because you have a Tesla, right? Yeah. It's a self-driving car. Yeah. Here's the example. So if you're driving in a Tesla mm-hmm. and it's on self-driving mode, right? Yeah. And it's got this computer brain and you're about to hit another car and there's, a, it knows that the other Tesla has four people in that car and you're just in one. It'll drive off the, the cliff because it'll kill one person instead of maybe kill five. Right. Oh, so hell what if no. all of these things. So it makes, make it makes <laughs> crucial, what's it called? Critical yeah. thinking. Yeah, yeah. But, but so fuck you, it Tesla. turns into Thanos, and it's just like the world needs to rid half of the, the humans. That's the thing, though. So, so like you, you're saying, oh, you're not talking about it being turned into Will Smith or whatever. But, but the reality is, is that um, it, it's artificial intelligence. Yeah. So it learns as it's going, which means that it's like, as it's living, so to speak. Yeah. It it's learning different you know, different scenarios. Yeah. yeah. So that could be a real scenario. Yeah. Yeah. No, that I, I hated that scenario because that can happen <laughs> yeah. to teach it critical thinking and, 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 and have it go, what's best, for what's, what's the best for, for society. Yeah, yeah, for society. Does this one person kill four or does this, yeah. Yeah. Or does the four survive and the one kills himself? What? Ooh, yeah. Yeah. Fuck you, Tesla. Yeah. Guess what? If that's an option on the screen, <laughs> it's turned off. Yeah. <laughs> Would you like to turn critical thinking on? Yeah. Fuck you, no. In fact, I'm turning this whole yeah, screen off. Yeah, that's the balance of it. You got to yeah. You got it. We, if we're gonna create it, we have to be able to stop it. Well, you have to that's, be able to say, "Save me, motherfucker." Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, save yeah. me, yeah. save but me. But you know what, man? What? Well, no matter what we do, uh, as far as technology is concerned, man, you can't teach. You can't create love, and you can't yeah. create yeah. real, true emotion. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I think that's what what Andrew's getting at is that it's it's great in certain scenarios, but like not for everything. Yeah, yeah. not for we, everything. we just can't. You can't create that, like you're saying. You can't. But you can't create it, this. Like what's happening right now, you can't not create, create it. You yeah. can't. If, if if we were on Zoom right now, it would be. This is why when we're in the room right now, we're all thinking of one thing: how to keep this entertainment going, right? Mm-hmm. And we're all feeding off each other. Whatever it is, I'm anticipating you like a, a mm-hmm. fucking double dutch game, yeah. you know, double dutch ropes. I'm, I'm timing it, I'm figuring it out, I'm listening, and I, whatever that yeah, is, yeah, right? Yeah. On Zoom, mm-hmm. I want to get to the microwave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to stick a hot pocket in right now. You're talking. I just scratched my dick. <laughs> That's me on Zoom. I just scratched then, my dick while you're talking. Yeah, yeah. And then, of course, Andrew's acting like he's on World News Tonight. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we'll be right back yeah. with the traffic. <laughs> Good morning, Iowa. Dude, I was on a Zoom and I was wearing my glasses and I got caught looking at other websites while we were in a meeting. Oh, I was just scrolling. Oh, that's, that's, funny, <laughs> so that's funny, dude. That's funny. Bro. That's but yeah. Thing. I yeah, farted the, during a Zoom. Yeah. And yeah. I saw and I saw that uh, like a trend, like I saw a trend, you know, th- like it was a gag, like they were doing the whole fart thing on yeah. Zoom or whatever the, the recreate or make it. I really fucking did it. I really fucking did it. Dude. What, ha- what happened? I f- played it off. Yeah. I, yeah. Because I kept pressing mute and then and then all that, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then finally I just I, I still thought I was on mute. It wasn't one of the hard big ones, but uh, it was it was, it, enough. was an, it was enough. It was enough for someone to go and uh, <laughs> I was like, motherfucker, dude. Play it off, dude. Play it off. Bang a bang a pen on the table. <laughs> what's, fucked up, what's fucked up is your frame lights up. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even think of that. All of a sudden my, my square's green. Oh fuck. 
Someone yells at the bottom of the screen, who farted for a thousand, Alex? <laughs> my, square, my square is green. Ugh. I, 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 will, I refuse... I refuse to uh, conform to the norm. Sorry. I'm an old man with a gray beard. Yeah. Yeah. I miss the 90s. <laughs> Things were new. Oh, God. I, miss, I miss the early 2000s when my friend said, this iPod will soon be a phone. <laughs> I still give credit to my friend Corey. Corey, fuck it, man. He should, that was some Nostradamus shit. He said that. One billion. I should have fucking took... Whatever money I had, which wasn't much, I was working at Nordstrom Rack, and I should have put it in Apple yeah. that mm-hmm. night because he literally he's he's a, he's a, a a technology freak, and he, I remember when he bought that iPod. He's one of those guys that saves everything, the box, mm-hmm. the instruction manual, and he lays it out nice, and everything's beautiful. You know what I mean? And props the iPod up, and it's all beautiful. You know, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. What's something new? And I remember him looking at the iPod, and he goes, "They're gonna put a phone on this." Damn! I swear to God, he goes, "Watch." He goes, give it maybe three years or five years. No way. I swear. He goes, five years. They're going to put a phone on this. Wow. One. And this is the black and the yeah. black and gray screen. Yeah. And I remember laughing at him like this. <laughs> <laughs> You're a fucking idiot. Hey, let's go get crab legs. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. Yeah. I was That, that was my dad moment. Yeah. I remember when I was buying bo- bottled water and my dad goes, <laughs> <laughs> well, <you're a> bottled water. <laughs> and then he went, he went and got a cup. I remember, I swear, my dad did this. My dad was like, can I get a cup? <laughs> no, one of the coffee cups. <laughs> hey, which, is, which is the one that squirts out, uh, you, you know how Coca-Cola yeah, has yeah. water? It has the no, yeah, I remember. Oh, no, no. <laughs> Just got water. <laughs> Went to my dad's house. Guess what he loves? Evian. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's, it's amazing, man. It's crazy. Dad, you want tap water? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't even brush my teeth in the shower. Are you trying to kill me? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking asshole. What happened to your special cup at 7 <laughs> Eleven? You're the same way, Andre. Don't act like you're not. What do you mean? You're an old ass man too. What are you talking about? You don't conform. I'm hip. I'm hip. Oh, you're not hip. <laughs> you got six to, blues on. I'm up to. I'm, and the I'm other, to, the other blue is yeah. your ankles. Yeah. You forgot to put lotion on it. <laughs> <laughs> you are fucking. You are quarantined. This motherfucker forgot to put lotion on his ankles. I'm gonna take a picture. Hey man, all the technology giants dress like this. What the fuck are you talking? about? <laughs> That's how millionaires dress now. Bro. Yeah, man. That's goddamn right they do. Dude, I'm telling you, man. I don't know. I don't I don't want to conform. I really don't. I'm not gonna do yeah. I can't you know, I just I'll show you my text right now. Someone texted me and God bless her heart, I love her. But she texted me this this amazing virtual reality comedy show. Yeah. Yeah. You know, and it's a roast. And you get you know, Joe, I'll be able to pay you. And I love her. She's she's a genius, Sarah. Uh and she kills it. But uh no. Yeah. No, no. There's something about a roast in person. Yeah, like you can't play the dozens virtually. No, that's that's, that's strange. Yeah, it's that's right an, here. Energy thing. Yeah, yeah for you know sure. what I mean, yeah. Me, I wouldn't have been able to see your ashy ankles if we were on Zoom. <laughs> I know. There's no way I would have got true. that. Well, first of all, I yes? wouldn't have had clothes on from the waist down. Oh, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. You would have witty the poo dip the whole time. <laughs> Have you done any comedy shows online? Nope. I refuse. Yeah. You have. I, d- I, did, I knew yeah. it. I yeah, fucking I did, knew yeah. this little kid would have. I, tr- I tried, dude. It was hard. It was so hard. It's, uh, of course it is. Yeah. You know Do you know how yeah. hard it is just a Zoom meeting? <laughs> <laughs> and now you want me to make you laugh? Now, it's, now it looks like I'm doing stand-up to people that live on Mars. Yeah, yeah. Like the, the, the tape delay. Like, oh, blah, 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 blah. And then all of a sudden, like five seconds. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 No. It feels like they're laughing at me the entire time. Uh, like they just, are. Like, hey, hey Andrew. Dummy. They are. <laughs> I don't want to fucking tell jokes yeah. while some asshole is enjoying a surf and turf. <laughs> <laughs> Asking for gravy. Honey, you get gravy? <laughs> yeah, this guy's telling jokes. He's telling, He's telling jokes. Uh, yeah, there's a, dead, there's a dead spot in his routine. You got some yeah. gravy and some butter? Yeah. No. Yeah. I'm done. <laughs> 
You only did one? Did you do more I, than I one? Did, you, I you did, did one, one, dude. I couldn't do it again. You but yeah, like that same, it felt but, like. So that's, so that's the thing. He's young. He's 30. Yeah, and, he's part and, of this generation. And he's part of the generation, but he has limits. Yeah, also. I know where the energy where the energy is needed, yeah. and that's 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 the main yeah. thing, man. Like, but I, you know, again, I'll just go back to the stocks thing, or like, fi- like in the pandemic, the internet made my life so much. Like, I, I was part of communities yeah. on Reddit. Yeah, you know, like I, I had social media. I, I got off of Instagram and Facebook and all those things, but I stayed on Reddit and I stayed like Zoom meeting Which my friends dark, and stuff. Dark that, web. Yeah, dark web. I mean, I dude. I'm yeah. about the internet now, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I love, like, I love I'm like the, the most 30 year old thing I've ever said. I'm yeah. about the internet. Yeah, he's now, about bro. the internet. You, so you gave up IG and I and gave it all up. TikTok. And, yeah. And then I, you devoted all that time to Pornhub. Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> I got a so profile. I don't know if it really now. made you better. <laughs> Man, I got to get away from IG and all that. All those. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yo, I just need to clear my mind. Yeah, I got all my, all my the, lovely. And, and then the Pornhub yeah, song yeah, comes on. Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, Isaac. Isaac, can you cue up the Pornhub <laughs> intro? Uh, can you play it in my ear? Uh, I want to hear it. I want to do it. <laughs> it's going to be funny. Isaac has it on his phone. You know, for six months, man, or the pandemic, I just wanted to clear my mind from all that smut. You know, that smut. Yeah. IG yeah. and TikTok and Snapchat. Uh-huh. I just want to, like, cleanse myself and say, hold on, let me pick up, let me open up my phone. Let me show you what I've been looking at. Oh, here we go. Oh, 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 hold on, that was the last window. God damn it. That was the last window. I forgot to close that window. My cookies. Ah, <laughs> I got to clear the cookies. <laughs> yeah, so I, I don't really think IG and TikTok was really corrupting your mind. No, no, no. I think it's that Andrew Lopez Pornhub profile that you got. Just hit subscribe. At me, bro. I got it. I got at breast wishes. Oh my god! <laughs> at breast wishes. I love it, dude. Hilarious. Nothing wrong with that, man. That's hey, what man. we need. Yeah, we're normalizing it. Bro. We're, we're normalizing yeah. it. That's yeah, fine. Do you think it's uh, corrupting our youth? Because what I had to struggle, and we hear this all the time. Like everyone that's that's my Dre and I's age, we always talk about how hard it was to get a piece of pornography. We called yeah. it pornography. <laughs> yeah, dude, you know what I mean? Yeah, a did, loose yeah. magazine that had crinkled pages. <laughs> One had semen obviously on it, yeah. but we didn't say anything <laughs> about that. We believed this story that he spilt chocolate milk on that page. We believed him. Yeah, we get it, Steve. He spilt a little milk on that one. Yeah, I spilled milk on that one, but you could use the other pages. Right. Yeah, right. sure. All bent up, used. We all used it. These are even stuck. I had a friend. Yeah, I had a friend that had a, a porn collection. Well, yeah. it was his dad's, and he would steal them. Yeah, he was stealing. I, I, he'd let me use it. He, that's how he would give it to me. Yeah, I had yeah, a, friend, a could, friend of mine. We used to go and, uh, we, you know, his parents weren't home. We'd yeah, go yeah. in his dad's dad's room so, and just yeah. jerk off. Yeah. yeah. Well, no. My well, generation well, went well, creepier. Dude, we used to print them off, bro. We'd print them on computer paper and just have them crinkled up in our <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jesus yeah. Yeah. wow. Library time, dude. Jeez. You <laughs> printed it at, yeah, the, at, the, at the school library, bro. Sixth grade. I remember. I think it was. Um, she, oh, actually, the first one I remember printing off, it was uh, Sable from WWF. She, she was on Playboy. Wow, we, that's wow. a good get. We, yeah, 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 we got yeah. that, on, we yeah, got that yeah. on computer sheet paper, dude. My, wow. favorite, my favorite Playboy of all time uh-huh. was Anna Nicole. Okay. Oh, yeah. I think her last name Classic. was Smith, right? Smith, yep. yeah. Um, the guest model? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lord. Yeah, she was. Lord have mercy. Yeah. It was my favorite book magazine <laughs> of all time. <laughs> You show a kid that now, yeah. and they're gonna be like, "What the what? fuck is this? Yeah, what is that? What is this? That's not porn. <laughs> this is porn. <laughs> yeah, those are sort of like senior pictures now. That's like, yeah, exactly. Uh, glamour, she was, glamour I mean, shots. Look how glamorous she is, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She was beautiful. No, she was dope. She was beautiful. Yeah. Um. So, anyways, you uh took yourself away from the internet. Oh just no, the, no, just, just the social media part of it. What what was it that media. you hated? Well, you know what it was? It was the it was um well first of all, like with coronavirus and stuff, I just like was finding myself on it too much and no one was doing shit. Yeah. It was just a lot of people complaining. And yeah. it was also mm-hmm. like during around the mm-hmm. political time. So it was like I just wanted to rid that for myself. Yeah. And yeah, I did go on Pornhub a lot after, but it was like but you, you need know, that because you need to also because yeah, that was positive. That was a yeah, positive thing it is to go positive. see. And then you know? it's a negative. Yeah, it, yeah. It's after, a positive immediately then, after. No, no, no. It's it's a positive and then quickly <laughs> a negative. <laughs> right after. Yeah, yeah. not yeah, right yeah, after. Yeah, yeah. Quickly yeah. after. 
the, the yeah, second yeah, yeah. after. That's a lot yeah. of, there's a lot of regret. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's it hurt. Yeah, it hurt. It hurt. I took you ever, a lot of you ever watch? You ever? You ever? Uh, you ever do? I don't know how to say it without being gross. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> hey, when you finish, do you ever say this? God damn it! Yeah. <laughs> I, yeah, yeah, I am. Why yeah. am I doing this yeah. again? God so damn enough. it! Again. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. I hate the sigh. I get the sigh a lot. Just <sighs> oh, disappointment. <laughs> oh, fucking disappointment. <laughs> What the fuck did I do again? Yeah. <laughs> then 35 minutes later, God, God damn it. I, <laughs> I said I wasn't going to do it. I said I wasn't going to do it. I said I, said I was going to yeah. rid myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. God damn it. 10 minutes yeah. after that. Yeah, God yeah. damn. Yeah. Maybe we go meditate for five minutes, three minutes into meditation. Yeah. God damn. <laughs> Uh, how about this one? How about how about the sixth time? Right, the sixth time that week you go like this. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Nothing. Just yeah. dry heave. Yeah. Just At that point, heave. I'm trying to. I'm like, I can go eight. I can do a new record today, no. dude. <laughs> it's done. It's, it's tapped it's out. Done. Dude. I yeah. yeah. I'm. I'm. I don't know, man. I I I I I love IG. I love yo. I just got on TikTok. Yeah. My yeah. son told me to get on it. Yeah. You're going to kill it on there, bro. I know. I just hit a million followers in like four weeks. That's so crazy. Sick, bro. I literally, it just happened today. Yeah. It was so crazy. But I was just like, but you know what I love about it, man? There's actually, I feel like when I'm on IG, there's some type of uh, uh, suppression. Yeah, absolutely. Right? Like they don't let me really engage with. Yeah, 100%. All of my fans. Yeah. I feel like they, they limit it. Because I could see it like right when I post something, I see it to get like. Just yep. going away, going, and then yeah. all of a sudden, like the yeah. brakes. So I'm like, no, yeah. that's crazy. There's no way. Uh, who's that? What's that one? That's your hashtag. You have 70 million views on TikTok. Oh, that's, that's crazy. Cool. Yeah. That's crazy. See, Can you, you pull up mine? Up, Can man. you pull up mine? Yeah, let me see. Yeah, I posted something. It fucking 25, 27 million yeah. views on one on Here, one video. Here's my theory about this. You doing this now though, which I think is cool, is that like. Because when, when the pandemic shit is mm -hmm, over, mm -hmm. like people are going to want to see live shows again and you're going to have a whole other generation familiar with you, yeah, which is crazy. really True. cool. And they're yeah. going to want to see you live, bro. Yeah. Dude, there was one, the, the one I'm talking about right there, it's at 20, is it at 27 million? Can you see it? It's, uh, the, it's the one that's at, this one? Yeah, the one with the letter M next to the number. Yeah. No, don't play it. Just uh, no, what, it's twenty seven million. Wow, twenty seven million. When did you put? When did you start posting? I posted. Oh, I just started posting four weeks ago. That's sick, bro. That's crazy. Big shout out to Amanda Cerny. Uh, you know, someone had my name. Yeah, that's why uh, I never went on TikTok. Yeah. Oh, someone took your handle. Yeah. yeah. So, so uh, I'm gonna tell you the story. So I had so the minute I found out TikTok was out. Someone called me and go, hey, you need to get uh, your name on TikTok. And, I, and I, by the way, I always have my name. Mm -hmm. Whenever I find out something news out, I get it, right? I, I may not use it, but I get it. For some reason, I was like 30 minutes late on TikTok. <laughs> and I remember typing in Joe Coy and it, and it said someone had it. And I was like, you got to be kidding me. Right. So I got TikTok 2, TikTok and then the number 2. And then uh, uh, Joe Coy and the number 2. And, and then I was like, man, fuck, I ain't going to use this yeah. shit. So right. I always had... Yeah. So, like, if you look at the date of it, you'll see that I've always had a TikTok, but I didn't. Right. I just never use it because right. I, I was like, I'm not going to use it until I get my name. Right. So we kept sending emails and emails to to all these people, and then to the point where we were just like, man, eh, fuck it. They're yeah. not they're not going to give it to us. They're, it looked like their policies were different. You know what I mean? Even though we were trying to prove to them that I'm the real Joe Coy, they weren't having it right. And then, uh, and then one day, this is like literally four weeks ago, mm -hmm. or five weeks ago, uh. I just, uh, Jacob, Jacob, go, Jacob goes, why don't you reach out to Amanda? You know, Amanda Cerny. She's the queen of mm -hmm. yeah. TikTok and Instagram, right? So I call, I texted Amanda and I go, I hate to do this, man, but I'll, I just want to pull that one card, that one card. I'll yeah. never ask you for anything else. Can you help me get my, my name on mm -hmm. TikTok? Bro, one email. Wow. And I, the the way she wrote it was so dope. This is yeah. my good friend, and and uh, he's blah blah blah, and, uh, la la la. And I'm I'm really looking. Oh, and I and I'm I'm really excited to uh, see what you guys do for him because we want him part of this family, don't you? <laughs> and I can't wait to do stuff with him. And I'm looking forward to seeing the content he posts on TikTok. Let's make this happen right away, you guys. Yeah, bro. 
the next day. Hey, Joe Coy. Hey, uh, what was that other uh, person that had your TikTok? And what's your old TikTok? Like no, the no. next day. That's dope, man. I had yeah. it. And you know what they did? Whoever had my name is now TikTok too. <laughs> they just switched <laughs> up. Did, did they? Oh, you switched? They switched no, they up. did it. Yeah. They made that person TikTok too. Wow. Yeah. And then gave you uh, mine. So Amanda Cerny, man, she's amazing, That's man. That's dope. That's dope. Yeah. 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 So, uh, cool. but yo, crazy. 27 million on that one yeah. one thing. Uh, it, it's crazy. I, I could be wrong about this too, but with the Instagram TikTok thing, the thing I also find is that TikTok feels like it's it's fun. Again. Yeah, like it it's is. It's silly and there's jokes yeah. on there. It yeah. felt yeah. like Twitter back in like 2009. Yeah. Where yeah. Were having fun again. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, it, Instagram just felt so negative for a little bit. Instagram but, still is. Yeah. Uh, it, it also looks like you're being watched. Oh, what do you mean? <clears throat> like, I feel like, well, cause it, like back in the day I could type in anything and I'd be like, oh there, yeah, I yeah. want to watch that. Now it's like, oh no, it's, that's censored. Oh, that doesn't oh, exist yeah. anymore. Mm. Uh, oh, that mm -hmm. sucks. This person lost their account. Yeah. Oh, yeah. this is like, no yeah. man, that's yeah. not what life is. Well, let us, let us look at everything, man. Mm -hmm. Well, part of Don't tell us what we can look at. Well, part of the issue is that, is that one platform bought the other platform and that platform is, is built on data and people paying for that data. Yeah. And if you're not paying for the data, yeah. Then they, yeah. That that's why you're feeling that suppression. It became business. Yeah. It's, it's a business. Yeah. So so you it's not it's not what what we would like it to be. Yeah. Is where we create and it's fun and people are gravitating yeah. to what you create and it's you know free usage. Yeah. You're it feels like it's, it's 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 supposed to be free, but it's not. Yeah. yeah, unfortunately. Do you, get, do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, I yeah. get it. I get what you're saying. But there's also a control factor. Like, I get what you're saying, right? It's mm -hmm. not free. So we got to suppress it because we don't want you to have complete control of something that we can monetize. Mm -hmm. But that's that's not my complaint because that makes sense, mm -hmm. right? Like, mm -hmm. duh. Mm -hmm. Like, I would do that if I owned that fucking thing. Okay. Like, oh, you got 50 million followers? Well, then you're going to have to pay if you want to, like, promote okay. shit. Okay. We're not going to just let you make money on this platform. We own it. Mm -hmm. But... What I'm saying is, let all content be. Let mm. it, whatever you're going to put, put. Let mm. them put it. Mm. Like, don't, let, I get it. You own it. Yeah, we own it. We're allowed to put, but then you're like, I don't know how to say it, man. It's just, I think, I think with the internet, it, it, it's brought this community to where we all can just share, mm -hmm. share our thoughts and our opinions mm -hmm. and, and live free. It, it, you know what I mean? The way that we should live. And and I think the minute that you get this person being able to tell you what you can look at, what you can't, can't post, then it just gets, it gets easier for them to do that with everything else. Yeah. I think, it, I, I think it also comes down to the thing too, where it's like, obviously there's extremes and that's not what we're talking about. It's just like people who are, I think, normal people who want to express their creative yeah. things or their opinions yeah. should be able to do that. And then the extreme should be looked at if it's going to harm something or it's something truly insane, like yeah. Yeah, those right. things obviously should be handled like anything, but like I totally yeah, but where, How do you, but how do you, uh, uh, other than doing what they're doing, how do you police that? How do you say yeah. it? I don't, yeah. Cause you either have to say the people have to say it, but mm -hmm. unfortunately they can't cause it's scary. You need, yeah. you need power. You need powerful people to be able to well, fight powerful people. Well, but how do, but how does, how do the people say, this shouldn't be what I post is good, but this shouldn't be here. That's Instagram. Instagram no, no, is no. doing that. No, no, no. I'm saying the people, the people can't say that. Like, you know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. the people can't. No, I know what I'm saying is I want people. If, if, if you're going to post nasty, crappy shit, then yeah. that's you. I, I have a finger that scrolls up. In fact, yeah. I won't even click it. Cause I don't like that shit. Uh, if someone's going to do this kind of joke, Good. Do that joke. Yeah. It has nothing to do with me. Yeah. You know what I mean? I don't listen to that. Yeah. It, it's just like country and rap. Yeah. I only listen to rap. I don't listen to country. But if I if if the most powerful people in the world only listen to rap, they're like, you know what? No more of that country shit on yeah. this platform. Yeah. That's fucked up. Yeah. Yeah. I I, 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 I hate and I hate to do this again. Yeah. <laughs> I hate yeah, do you're doing it. I hate it to again. push back again. Yeah. But I'm gonna push back again. Yeah. A little bit. Um, you don't mind. No, I don't. Okay. Um, so I, and I 100% agree with you, actually. Yeah. The only problem with that is, is that um, if everyone had the same sense of discernment that you do yeah. to know the difference, yeah. that would be great. But yeah. Every, everybody does not. So there are people who are scrolling through stuff. Yeah. 
and they don't understand the difference between right and wrong, right and wrong, or reality and comedy, and well, yeah, they just don't. They, they their sense of the world is not the same. Yeah, but that but that's not up to us to decide. Well, what what they look at, you know what I mean? They're still human. But it has you're, to you're be not up, gonna. It has to be up to someone. No, it doesn't because no, no, because a crazy person is going to be crazy no matter what. So that's that's like me telling my brother that he can't look at this because I say it's bad. But my brother's going to be like, but I like looking at it. It's like he's going to look at it no matter what. He's crazy. People are going to be crazy no matter what. There's there's different levels of crazy. There's schizophrenic and then there's people that are like Johnny Depp. <laughs> 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 this motherfucker's been nine characters in one calendar year. I see to be a pirate. So, I see to become a Frenchman. I see to be a fucking cowboy. And then I saw him play Tonto. And he believes it. But who am I to tell him that he can't? And who am I to tell him that he can't? But what I'm saying, I, I get what you're saying. I, I yeah. do, and I really do. But what I'm saying is that is that so is your stance that any that any speech should be yes. this fair game? One million percent. Good, I, I good, know. good cannot be recognized if there's not bad. LeBron no, there, James a, is not good. A, LeBron James is not good if there's a thousand. Uh, if there's only LeBron James is on the floor. But that, we're talking about differences of there's a there's a place for discourse. There's a place for people to one to, billion percent. There's a place but, for there's a place for people to disagree. Yes, but that's different than hate. Okay, this I, I understand what you're saying. I one hundred percent. I love you. Okay, I'm gonna play the devil's advocate. I hope so. And I don't want to play. Let's take the two extremes. <laughs> yes. We'll take KKK, mm -hmm. and then we'll just take whatever movement on the other side. <laughs> what the, whatever movement what does that, that mean? Ain't, what does that mean? Whatever movement uh, I've seen, I've seen extreme uh, black leaders hating. Uh, well, well, let's name it. I mean, if we're gonna. Name I don't, that, I don't know them though, it. but I, I've walked okay. the streets of uh, New York City, and I don't know the name of them, but okay. I've heard them okay. lash enough. out, "White Devil," blah blah blah. Fair enough. And it literally, and you know who I'm talking about. I don't know what they're called, but yeah. they're no, I know that exists. I know that exists. No. Yeah, but what I'm saying is, okay. I don't want to take that away from them. They have the right to do that, and just like you have the right to make a decision whether or not that's right or wrong. I have the right to do that. I don't have the right to walk in your house and do that. I don't have the right to walk in your place of business and do. They're that. not walking in your house. Well, they're in somebody's place of business. Instagram is a place of business. I understand that, but you're banking on the fact that you are pro providing a free, a free service. Nope. Okay. I mean, because because is someone's I, phone ringing? It's it's mine. I'm sorry. Yeah, it, you just if you don't mind, this is the best part of the buzzing. pod right it's now. It's buzzing. <laughs> <laughs> it's, the most, it's, the most, it's the most dramatic we've ever gotten, and this motherfucker won't won't press decline. It's the organization calling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen to us right now. It's the extreme black. The extreme people. blacks are calling. Do you no, want me to Bluetooth uh, it in? <laughs> hey, you tell that white motherfucker. <laughs> He's my brother-in-law, and, and he's Asian, and he's Asian. Fuck both of them. <laughs> no, but um, where was I? It is still a, a private business. So you can't, like, I can't walk in Kentucky Fried Chicken and, and start spouting off shit without It them. is a private business, and it's also a public business, right? It's on, it's, 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 it's on, it's on Wall Street, right? They got investors. They got people investing. But it's not a, it's not a government. And what I mean by private, it's not a government-ran business. As, as far as far as I know, I don't want well, anything to be government <laughs> ran. Yeah, that's the thing, though, too. Is that but that's that's where freedom of speech lies. Is is with the government. It doesn't lie with private entities. They can't. You can't just say I, I can come in here and say anything, and it's my freedom. It's my yeah. First Amendment right. Yeah. Uh, all right. Well, I, then I agree with you. Yeah, I agree with I you one hundred percent. You don't have to. I just, 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 you know. If we're talking about you that, you have to be all snubby. <laughs> You're the one that didn't answer your fucking phone. <laughs> I agree with you. Yeah, but. I also think when you're holding, I don't know, when you have something like that, there's a responsibility, right? So you're saying that your responsibility, their responsibility is to monitor and 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 censor uh, people that don't share the same beliefs. That's what you're saying. No, not at all. I think the exact opposite of that. I think that people people should have be able to believe whatever they want. Yeah. I think the problem is that you have to, but you also have to protect people from 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 hate crimes right. and 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 then and then the extreme that's what it turns to i'm not talking about people disagreeing yeah like people can disagree 
You know I mean, like, kind of like what we are doing right now. Well, like, well, no, exactly. And then, but then there's a higher level of disagreement when yeah. they start talking about like, oh, well, well, uh, Black Lives Matter, Matter is a terrorist group, and this person says, well, "Don't you fucking say that on my pod." <laughs> and then, or, or, and then, <laughs> or then or I hope they come after you. <laughs> Ooh, I hope they come after you. Ooh, I turned it on. <laughs> Don't you fucking say that. I support them. I, I sent money. You cut that little yeah, clip. Clip. Just, and then, and then, just, put it on TikTok. Clip. Ooh, TikTok. <laughs> Shit, 27 million views. Ultraviolet. <laughs> Joe Coy's black brother-in-law yeah. denounces yeah. BLM. <laughs> <laughs> Supports white supremacy. <laughs> Gotta get those views, bro. Oh, man. It's all about the Sorry, views, I had yeah. to do this to you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you know what I, You get what I'm saying. Like, 100%. But yeah, yeah. That, there's that level of disagreement. And then that level of disagreement turns into for people who are not, who, who can't, who, for people who cannot make, make, understand the difference, they take that level of disagreement and then they go out and do stupid shit. And that's where the problem lies. And I think once you do that, I think another problem will line up. What do you mean? I don't know. I just feel like when you... You have to protect stupid people from themselves. That's basically what I'm saying. And I think you can't. Unless well, you, you can... lock them up. I don't know. I, One million percent. Stupid well, I, I, person's going to... Stupid is as a stupid does. They're going to do it because they're stupid. They're going to hate because they hate. And they're never going to learn love. They're never, they're never not. Cause that's I don't just think what they are. I don't think people are trying to teach them love. I think people I'm are not trying saying to that they're going to teach. I think love. people are trying to keep them from. No, but what I'm saying others. is what, what I'm saying is you said hate, right? Mm -hmm. You're never going to teach somebody that hates love. You're not. Right. But, but you can, what I'm saying Suppress is, them. is taking the, keep that hate from becoming hate crime. Keep that hate become, from becoming like, I'm going to harm you because we feel differently about what we, you know what I mean? Like you, 100%. you and I are having a, a, a civil conversation about yeah. a, dis a different of, of, of opinion. Yep. There are some people out there, they may be Joe Coy fanatics. Yeah. I might not be able to walk down Ventura today. I'm telling you this right now. Yeah. I wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> but you get what I'm saying. Like 100%. people take shit to another level and, yeah. that, and that, it doesn't need to be there. But so do you feel that that should be controlled? I feel that that's 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 something that I, I feel that the government should not be able to control any of that. But ever. I but, but I think we that, agree on that. We agree on that 100 percent. But I but I think that people have the right business owners have the right to control what happens in their business. OK. Can, can we hug? Can we hug no, I, I agree <laughs> with you. I just I feel like there's businesses and then there's I think because the platform there's powerful is, businesses that control a population. And when I mean population, I mean but, the world's population. It's not it's not the local newspaper. It's something that's global. And and when you take away everything mm -hmm. like that, mm -hmm. then then now you're doing some type of control. So, uh, well, there's so there's a responsibility question. when you're allowing the world mm -hmm. to share and, and 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 express and that and mm -hmm. that was your whole point mm -hmm. of this particular platform and mm -hmm. i feel if you're going to do that then you need to share everything you have to mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. I, I, I you can tell me all the hateful shit you want mm -hmm. you can say it mm -hmm. i'm not going to follow you but i, know, I need but to see are, it i need to see it but though but there are people that will though that's the problem I know, but you can't control that, that. Cause even if you take it all away, Andre, we're not talking about something that's new. This, this shit's going to be with us till we die. Right. You know what I mean? Right. It, it was worse then and it's worse now. So, the, so I guess but I think with the power of that platform, mm -hmm. the, the ability to see both sides extreme mm -hmm. what, on love and hate. Mm -hmm. I think once you take all the hate away and you only see love, the mm -hmm. hate only gets stronger, mm -hmm. but I, you need that. You need that, 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 that palette. I agree, you and I agree, and I agree with that. I agree with that. But bro, I, I when think, I see when I see fucked up shit, yeah, you know what I mean, like mm -hmm. movies, like when I see Django yeah. or whatever. Did I say it right? Django. I don't know. I always I pronounce know. the D. Yeah. When I watch that shit, yo, like it, it emotionally hits me. Yeah. And so, but you need to see it. You know I, what I mean? I and don't. if you don't show it, I know you. But what <laughs> I'm, I'm saying kidding, is, I'm kidding. But what <laughs> I'm saying is, uh, that's something that needs to be seen for someone because I'll never understand. Mm -hmm. I'll never know yeah. if it's just a story given to me by Andre, yeah. my brother-in-law. Yeah. Because I'm just going to be like, okay. Yeah. 
Well, I, give uh, you, I don't know. Why are you? Why are you still mad? No, and I'll give you another. That's example. how I would act, right? Sure. But no. if you show it to me, mm-hmm. I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking join your army. Yeah. I'm like, yo, fuck you, dude. Yeah. So you need to see it, and that's all I'm saying. But that's different than. But that's different than allowing Andrew to spew his race. First racial. of all, I don't want him to spew anything. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. Especially coming out of a porn yeah, session. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially in Iowa. That's what I'm thinking about right now. All I can think now, about dude. right now yeah. is Iowa's covered in sperm. Just smothered and covered. I don't even want to eat corn anymore. It's every kernel I just think about Elote. Andrew. It's Elote. 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 That's not mayonnaise. Why is no, this corn what, so sweet? Yeah. Oof. So what, what about Andrew? Go ahead. Well, you just... you. That's different. You want you want people to, to see things in a in a in a in a way that they can be educated. And of course you have to show the real thing. You have yeah. to show what's real about it. Yeah. But I think what, what what I'm talking about is the extreme of that of having again Andrew, I don't know why I'm picking on him, but but spewing just racist garbage on the internet. Okay, let me give you a better example. Sure. Because I, I get what you're saying. Sure. One of course I get what you're saying. Yeah. But what you're this is this is what I'm getting from it. You're saying that we can help not get if we have if the platform shows a lot of hate, it might manipulate someone that's stupid to follow hate, right? Mm-hmm. But how many how many other people switch to good because they saw it? Look at the movement of BLM. Mm-hmm. Because yeah. they got to see what fucking horrible sure. shit was on the sure. internet. Yeah. And if that gets suppressed, you probably wouldn't have got the protests that you got. I agree with and that. And that's what I'm getting at. I agree with that. Let the motherfuckers say hateful I, shit and whatever fucking nasty thing that's in your fucking brain. Because I guarantee you, you're not going to get the army. You're not. Mm-hmm. The I, other I, I side will get the, uh, the, I the army. Yeah. No, I, I, I hear you on that. I just it, And that's it, a perfect example. Because no. BLM, sure. I'm not trying to hate. Yeah. But man, did I see a lot of white people. I saw yeah. a lot of white people. Yeah, no doubt. Voicing and and, and the reason why is because they saw. I they saw, saw. I saw. I saw a lot of people and, and that that I did not expect. Yeah. Um, voiced their views, and I was I was I was surprised. Yeah, I was, surprised. And, and I was, was pleasantly surprised. Yeah, and, and then and somebody that you know that you know well. Yeah, and I was just like, well, I did not know that that was that that person was that. I mean, I yeah. Can, you know, but, but but what I'm trying to, now now I'm gonna sum it up because this was a long one, and that's why I believe that you shouldn't censor on those platforms because that I'm telling you that is the reason why that BLM movement was so fucking strong, guaranteed. Mm-hmm. Okay, but but let me let me I mean before we sum it up. Yeah. Um, no. On the no, floor. it's my fucking pod. <laughs> it's my fucking pod. I get this. No, go ahead. On the, on take the, it. Well, just, I get it. BLM. No, no, no. You just, go ahead and sum just it. Just on the flip, but on the flip side of that. Um, you you have so derogatory. <laughs> yeah, there's two there's two Filipinos here, and you say flip, <laughs> canceled. <laughs> this motherfucker got canceled <laughs> twice in one pod. It was a slippery slope, Ooh, man. Man, <laughs> slope. slope. You just said slope. <laughs> This know, motherfucker ain't working for a long time. Know what that means. You better hope to God they censor this one. Yeah. <laughs> um. Uh, where was, where was that? You're on a slippery slope. Yeah. No, I was just going to say that. Um, but it all it's also powerful in organizing hate groups too, and so and yeah. that's and that's that's the thing that like you, you would, because you have people that are not only pushing out the hate, but then they're yeah. or, they're organizing, they're creating these, they're creating actual groups that are going to go out and one billion percent. Yeah, and that's and but that's, but but Dre, the KKK has been around since the beginning of time, mm-hmm. and with the power of the internet and 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 social media. They're still diminishing in memberships. Yeah. So what you're saying, what, I, I'm, saying, and, and, what, what I'm saying is, if you show how fucking stupid these motherfuckers are, mm-hmm. believe me, the other side's gonna grow. The that's, army's gonna grow. That's the hope. No, and that's I, and not I'm a with hope. you. And I'm with you. And I'm with you. Last year was a perfect example. No, no, no. But and I'm with you. Uh, this might be a bit much, but I'm going to say Don't go there. I'm going to say it Don't anyway. go there. I'm going to say it anyway. Now, if you call us one more derogatory <laughs> word, don't fuck it. If you say there's a chick in the armor, if you say there's a chick in the armor, Trey, we're done. We're done. Let's, really let's, think about it. Let's just say this. And, I, and I, since, since the, uh, since the, 
late 1600s. God damn, he brought it way back. There's a there's there's been a uh, there's a movement in this country to uh, here we go keep people divide, oppressed divided no divided oh divided oh, and the division bro that's happening now no I, no I'm saying since then yeah until now and the the movement is is exactly the same exactly the same so the the and the problem with that is that um the division has been made due to skin color right fuck yeah. And um, there is a, a, a segment of the unit of America and Americans that believe that they are in a better space because of their skin color, but they are being fooled by. Bro, you, okay, listen. I know you. Yes. I know you so well. Yeah. And you danced around that. Yes. You danced, you tippy-toed around that whole mm-hmm. fucking thing. You didn't mm-hmm. deliver it the way you wanted to, yeah. and you were careful with every single word that you said. Mm-hmm. I know exactly what you're saying, yeah. all right? But you don't want to say it. And the reason why is because those powerful fucking apps, I don't want to, what mm-hmm. we've been talking about this whole time, mm-hmm. has caused that kind of pressure on you. Because of censorship and, 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 and suppressing certain things and views and statements, you you danced around that. Well, because that's what's happening right now. When you take away that freedom to, to say what you wanted to say uh, on that platform, mm-hmm. you know damn well they would have suppressed that. Or it would have got hit hard. Yeah. It would have been... It, See, and that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. But and that, that's but, why. But see, that, and that's why if we, if we give up, if we, if we suppress the hate, then we can't even let you, the, 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 what you just said right there, mm-hmm. be said as well. But what and I just said, but what I just said is in a, in a history book. No, it's I, not, it's I not know, that, but you're, you're dancing around it because. I'm dancing around it because the people that are doing it is the people that run everything and they don't own Instagram. I know, man. <laughs> but, <laughs> you know what I mean? But, but what I'm saying is you, it. What I'm saying is you're kind of conditioned by it. If if I would if I was talking to you 15 years ago, yeah. you would have fucking said this so loud and right right to the point. Probably. No, for sure. Yeah. You were a rapper. Yeah. I've heard your shit. <laughs> yeah. 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 And 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 you're conditioned. And this is just stage one. This is just year one. Imagine year six. How conditioned people are going to be? They're not even going to dance around it. They, they're not even going to want to have that thought in their head. And that sucks. Yeah. I hear because you. that shit needs to be said. I and you. I need to see the hateful shit. Bro, I, I'm on your fucking team. And the yeah. reason why is because I saw it. Yeah. Like, I fucking saw it. Fuck you. Yeah. Fuck you. I hear you. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. I think we need to, We I think we really need to, uh, I, I think one thing that we lost during this pandemic is the love mm. that, that people have. Mm-hmm. Um, for one another in, in uh, unconditionally. Mm. I think we've lost that. And I think through zoom and the internet and Instagram and TikTok and, and the conditioning that, that we're seeing, like I've seen so many fights so, so far that yeah. it's, it's conditioning me that, Oh, that everybody hates everybody right now. And I'm on, I'm on, I'm, I'm tense now. And it's it, so bad to the point where I just want to walk away from these platforms and just masturbate to porn. Like my good friend, Andrew. <laughs> that sounds loving, man. That sounds like a lot of love in that person. Like a lot of love. <laughs> that is a lot, a lot of love. A lot of love. That guy's seeking some love. Right? <laughs> I think, okay, this is what I'm going to get at, Andre. That was such a great discussion. Yeah, I love sure. talking to you. And I, Andrew, thanks for coming on. But I think one thing that we've lost is the human connection. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. And, 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 and the trust. I think one thing we, 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 that we're, we're oh, God damn it, I'm stumbling on my words now. I had so much momentum earlier. Yeah. Uh, one thing that we're, we're missing is the trust with another human. Mm-hmm. Like we don't trust them anymore. Yeah. Social media and, and, and news has, has told us that Everybody doesn't trust anybody and everybody hates everybody. No, mm-hmm. that's not true, man. Mm-hmm. When you watch the media, man, they're showing you literally not even a percent of what's really going on in the world. True. Not even one fucking percent. And I mean that. Trust it, man. Here's, here, can, I, can I say something? Yeah. Here's the thing about that is that you, you end up in echo chambers. So you end up watching what you already know. Yeah. Right? Because they're, you're being targeted. Yes. So if I click on, if I go in right now, if I go in Facebook, Instagram, and I click on KKK rally mm-hmm. in North Carolina or whatever, yeah. Um, I click on two or three of them. 
eventually tomorrow that's going to pop up in my feed. Yeah. And then I start to believe what I see on yeah. a daily basis. Yes. And now I'm cut off from the rest of the world and this is all I see. All, yeah. all I'm seeing is what I've already looked at. I might be completely off about this, but I, I, I totally hear what you guys are saying, but I, I'm almost on the other side of that, what you were saying, Joe, but I think that people in the pandemic and also with what we're talking about with social media and, and everybody hating each other, I actually think that everyone's looking more for the truth and like you're saying about exposing it, like a lot of shit was exposed about a lot of people mm -hmm. and even people in our, on our small circles, I'm sure, you know, like you start to see people for how they really are when mm -hmm. they start to turn in the Joker during fucking pandemic times. Right. But I think what that made me do, and I can only speak for myself, is that I do seek the truth. And if mm -hmm. I'm looking at echo chambers, I am... I think the internet has made me realize that there is a bigger world out there yeah. and there are other people out there. Yeah. So I think the internet actually makes the echo chambers bigger. Like it makes the world bigger because everyone's talking about how it's, you're only on five pages on the internet. That's not, I got a hundred tabs open right now. Like we were but, talking about with BLM, like that video of George Floyd is a video that went viral. That's mm -hmm. the only reason the internet's yeah. the only reason yeah. why we saw that video. Yeah. yeah. I, and first of all, I just want to say that, Five different Pornhub tabs are not five, five tabs. <laughs> but, <laughs> Sorry about that, bro. Yeah. I mean, we, we respect your opinion. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've been, they're all different ethnicities. But like when Dre... Yeah. But, it's it's but like diverse Dre, actors in them. Yeah, listen, we love what you're saying. We believe you wholeheartedly. We, we love you to death. But like what Dre would say, there's a chink in the arm. <laughs> <laughs> cancel, cancel. No, I get what you're saying, yeah. but are you, are you are you talking about the the internet I, as a whole? Or, because social media yeah, is think, different in the way they I, target you. But though. that's the thing is, I think that everybody's always focusing uh, focusing on these extremes. Like, I think people, I trust in people, and I think that people are searching for love. And I think it made people actually pandemic made people seek love more. I think, mm -hmm. and I think we're ready to have the energy you're talking about. And I think that most normal people can see what's the truth and what's not. Yeah. We saw with the election. The percentage, the percentage yeah. is so much higher than what we think. And, I agree. and we and we yeah. tend and we tend to gravitate to that small percentage. Yeah, it's a small and we gotta stop, you guys. Love does exist. I know it's cheesy when you hear it, when you hear uh, you know, you hear Beatles sing all we need is love, but motherfucker, that's all we need. You need it. And then you need to trust. Trust, man. Believe me, the stuff I saw on the internet. I fucking thought everybody was killing everybody. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But then I saw my reality, my circle. Yeah. You know what I mean? Look who I'm hanging out with right now in this room. Yeah. There's a white guy. There's a black guy in front of me that's married to my Asian sister. Yeah. And there's an Asian guy from Iowa. That's <laughs> America. Yeah. yeah. And talk. it does yeah. exist. Yeah. What you see on the palm of your hand is not even a fraction. I don't even think there is a percentage. There's 9 billion people in the world and you're literally looking at nine people. Yeah. That's it. Mm -hmm. That's how sig insignificant the internet is. Yeah. There's more people than there are in, in, yeah. in on your phone. Whatever yeah. it is that you're looking at is nothing. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. trust, trust, man. Trust love. It does yeah. exist, man. And, I, and before we go, I just want to say that, that with all the stuff that we talked about, I, I think it, it was a great conversation. Um, I do think that we're in, uh, the best place that as a country that we've been, yes. even though it doesn't feel that way in the moment, yeah, man. in the moment, something, it, it, you know, it has to reset and we need mm -hmm. to see the fucking worst for it to be the yeah. best. Yeah. Dude. Open conversation is love to me. Like yeah. what yeah, you're saying about sure. like, like this diverse room that we have because you guys and we can all talk like this yeah. is what we want. You shouldn't be able to not speak your mind to a diverse room mm -hmm. and be able to yeah. not be blasted for, learning if yeah. anything you yeah, know man. like yeah. that's what we should be able to do this is a perfect example of what america really looks like there's a black guy there's an eight a full filipino a half white a half asian guy and we're 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 telling how we feel and how we uh, our views and then there's a white guy that's controlling it in the sound <laughs> and on the soundboard just pressing delete and, and turning down volumes and fucking up the sound <laughs> I'm gonna censor this one. <laughs> I think my mic has been turned off as you speak. Welcome to America. Welcome to America. <laughs> no, Isaac is beautiful. Isaac is beautiful, man. And 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 this is what I'm gonna close with, man. Trust, tr trust your gut. How's that, man? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. That's that's the that's the beautiful thing about being a human, man. That's one thing that these virtual glasses and and these little androids or whatever the fuck they're humanoids, whatever the fuck it is 
cannot make. You yeah. cannot rec- you cannot recreate the gut instinct, the sixth sense, the human, the humans, the human's ability to trust and 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 and, and also the ability to read. Read somebody, read the room, know when something's negative because they feel the negative energy in the room. That shit, you cannot, you cannot teach that. You can't make, I mean, you can't make it. Let's trust it, man. I know it's been a tough year, man, but I'm telling you, I'm telling you, man, when, 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 uh, when Iran and, and, and the U.S. were at war, that just when was that? that, that the 80s. No, 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 no oh, just, just recently. recently, just recently. When, when, yeah. uh, when we sh- when we killed the general, yeah. we were at war. There was this this huge thing about uh, the Iranian uh, to strike Americans and and any any American tourists that go to Dubai, we will kill you. That's what it said on the news. Mm-hmm. I was there the day after. Yeah, I was literally de- there the day after they went public on, on the news. The news said it. The news made it so scary. Watch out for these Iranians. These Iranians will kill you. Be careful. They're they're going to attack you. We killed one of them. They're going to kill 10 of us. Yeah. Be careful. I was wearing the full on <laughs> Arab outfit. Yeah. In Dubai. Yeah. Standing at the top of uh, what was it called? Was Khalifa? Yeah, the, t- it was the top. It was Khalifa. Yeah. It was Khalifa. <laughs> I, was t- I was at the top. What is it called? It's something Khalifa. Burj. What? Burj. Burj Khalifa. I'm at the top of it. Yeah. With these two Muslim guys, man. So fucking dope. Muhammad was one of his names. Muhammad was one guy. And this is literally as I, 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 bro, I'm in the Philippines when I'm about to get on this plane, scared for my fucking life. Looking at my manager going, let's cancel this. And he's like, bro, we got too many tickets. Yeah. You can't. I was supposed to be at the Coca-Cola Arena. I go, dude, why aren't they canceling this? It's all over the news. Everything, CNN. They're fucking, they're going to kill us. They're going to kill us. That's what they're saying. And we call Dubai and they're like, what? What are you talking about? Get over here. People are waiting for you. <laughs> Can we add people to the meet and greet? <laughs> Real talk, Andre. Yeah. My son was supposed to go with me. Yeah. But because of this fucking internet and fucking M- uh, the, the uh, media, I'm just like, I told my son to stay home. And I landed in Dubai. I get greeted by this, this one Arab guy. He, his dad is a head of marketing of the Versace. He got me into this. And uh, Muhammad got me to the top of Burj Khalifa. He goes, next time, bring your son. We'll ride camels and, and Lamborghinis. And, and la-. <laughs> bro, it was all love, bro. Yeah. There was no race. There was no religion. There was no skin color. It was all love, bro. Yeah. That's I'm telling you guys, stop stop letting what you see dictate how you feel. It it's not real. It really is. It's 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 fun to look at and enjoy it, but you know what? Love is love is bigger than that. Real talk. And, YOLO and, and baby. Really though. These humans are real. Humans are fucking real. Yep. So I love you, Andre. Love you. I love you, uh, Andrew. I love you, man. What, Isaac, love you. One second. Love you, love. Motherfucker. One second. What are you going to say? Um, what you have just described here yeah. and what we are in this room yeah. and what we are supposed to be in America and we'll get there one day is yeah. a mixed plate. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mixed plate, you guys. That's my book, uh, Chronicles of an American Combo, All-American Combo. It, it's great, man. I got deep. I told some stories that made me cry. I had to do the audio uh, version of it. And if you ever get a book, you guys, when you do, actually not whenever, when you get your book, when you write your book, Andre, when you write yours, Andrew, which you should, both of you, um, bro, don't do the audio. <laughs> do not do the audio book. I'm telling you, do not do it. It's emotional. It's hard. Uh, it took me two weeks to do it because I, I, I just couldn't get through each chapter. Like it, 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 is, it is very, very hard. Yeah. And uh, but it and, it and this this book means a lot to me. So I cannot wait for you to read it. Go online; it's on everything: Barnes and Noble, Apple, everything, uh, JoeKoy.com, whatever you want, man. So I love you guys. Love, love you, Koi Pond. Thanks for diving in, Andrew. Oh, Dandrew, uh, you can go to Andrew. Yep. On uh, uh you can watch him on In His yeah, Elements, yeah. Uh, uh, Netflix. Yeah, yeah, on Netflix on Joe's special. Um, uh, Pornhub at Breast Wishes. At Breast Wishes. Um, yeah, Venmo. That's about Venmo. Venmo. <laughs> I love you guys. <laughs>